Are you stuck trying to update Android Studio only to be met with a frustrating error message? You're not alone. Today, we're going to tackle the issue of Android Studio not having right access and get you back to coding in no time. I totally get it. Running into permission issues can be incredibly annoying, especially when you're eager to get started on your project. This is a common problem that many developers face, so don't worry, we will sort it out together. Let's dive into the specific issue at hand. One user reported that while trying to update from Android Studio 3.0 Canary 1 to Canary 2, they encountered an error stating that Studio does not have right access to a specific directory. Sound familiar? If so, let's explore how to resolve this. So, what does this error mean? Essentially, it indicates that the application does not have the necessary permissions to modify files in the specified directory. This can happen for various reasons, including security settings on your Mac. Stay with me. By the end of this video, you'll not only fix this issue, but also learn some tips to prevent it from happening again in the future. To resolve the issue of right access in Android Studio, the user should first check the permissions of the application folder. This can be done by navigating to the folder in Finder. Next, the user should ensure that they have the necessary permissions to write to the folder. If the permissions are not set correctly, they can modify them in the Get Info window. After adjusting the permissions, the user should try launching Android Studio again. This time, it should have the required access to update. If the problem persists, the user can try moving the application to a different location, such as the Applications folder, and then attempt the update again. Lastly, if none of these steps work, the user may consider reinstalling Android Studio. This can help reset any permissions or configurations that might be causing the issue. Fun fact, did you know that the first version of Android Studio was released in 20s and 13? It has come a long way since then, but permission issues still seem to be a recurring theme. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution from another user suggests that the command you used was incorrect. They recommend using this command instead, sudo applications android studio 3.0 preview.app slash contents slash macOS slash studio. Let's take a moment to review another user's answer. One user faced the same write access error when updating Android Studio. Their solution was to copy the Android Studio app from a private folder to the Applications folder, which resolved the issue. Let's take a moment to review another user's answer. One user found that the issue was due to not opening Android Studio from the Applications folder. They suggest ensuring you open the version located there as using a copy saved elsewhere may not have the necessary privileges. That's the end of that answer. Let's see another perspective. One alternative solution comes from a user who faced a similar issue on Big Sur. They suggest moving the Android Studio application from the Downloads folder to the Applications folder. After doing this, they reopened Android Studio and tried the update again, which resolved their problem. That's the end of that answer. Let's see another perspective. One user advises against running Android Studio with sudo as it grants full root access, which can lead to security issues. They point out that the problem lies in the temporary folder, not the application itself. When running Android Studio 3.x, it appears to be mounted in a read-only state, which is not the case for previous versions. This could be a new feature causing the issue, but the problem remains unresolved. Here's a pro tip. Always ensure that your applications are installed in the correct directories and that you have the right permissions set. This can save you a lot of headaches down the line. And there you have it. With these steps, you should be able to resolve the right access issue in Android Studio. Remember, keeping your permissions in check can help you avoid similar problems in the future. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more troubleshooting tips.